For any parent, the child is the most precious gift of their life. Parents always wish happiness and success for their child and try to fulfill all their needs and demands. Despite of all this unconditional love and care, if a child is unable to perform well at school, play or home, and have trouble sustaining attention, being easily distracted by internal or external stimuli, jump from one task to another without completion, problems with organization, difficulty in focusing and executing on tasks. All this leads to many fears and worries in parents' mind. They start thinking, is everything okay with my parenting? Or is there is something wrong with my child? Is everything okay at school? Hope no one is troubling my child at school or play. And the list is endless. Today in this video, we will get an answer to all these queries from consultant psychiatrist Dr. Rajiv Kumar Sharma according to DSM-5 criteria of ADHD in attention in children. Case study A parent of 8-year-old girl child visited a beautiful mind clinic. They look quite anxious and worried. During counseling session, they shared our daughter is unable to focus and concentrate on studies. Even while doing her classwork and homework, she makes a lot of silly mistakes. When we teach her at home, her mind is always wondering. She has list of excuses like my pencil is not sharpened or I don't have the razor or I want to drink a glass of water or I need to go to the washroom. Mother told, Doctor, every day in the morning, I make sure to keep pencil, eraser, sharpener, scale, crayons, everything in her bag. But often she leaves her pencil, eraser or books at the school and sometimes even forgets to bring back her water bottle. She finds it difficult to organize her things and when I call her, she doesn't listen and she seems to be busy in her own thoughts. Doctor, she jumps from one task to another without completion. She has difficulty focusing and executing on tasks which require concentration and focus, like doing homework or classwork, or to copy something from the board, or even listening to the teacher's lecture. Because of this, every day I need to WhatsApp to other parents to get her classwork and homework. She don't like games which need focus and concentration like playing Ludo or making any puzzle. But in case of outdoor sports, she enjoys them a lot. After listening to parents and taking the detailed history of the child and after doing psychiatric assessment, it was confirmed that the child is suffering from ADHD in attention disorder, in which a child has problem in concentrating and focusing on things. According to DSM-5, the symptoms of ADHD are hyperactivity, impulsive behavior and inattention. There is a dedicated video for hyperactivity and impulsive behavior. You can watch it. In this video, we will talk about ADHD in attention. According to DSM-5, ADHD in attention has 9 symptoms. Symptom number 1. Often fails to give close attention to details or make careless mistakes at schoolwork, at home or other activities. Symptom number 2. Difficulty in sustaining attention in tasks or play activities. Difficulty in focusing and executing on tasks which require focus and concentration, for example, doing homework or classwork or to copy something from the board or listening to class teacher's lecture. Symptom number three, often don't listen when called. Mind seems to be somewhere even in absence of any distraction. The child doesn't listen and he is busy in its own thoughts. Symptom number four, does not follow through on instruction and fails to finish classwork homework in given time. ADHD inattention child has difficulty focusing and executing on tasks, therefore, find it difficult to finish his homework and classwork in given time. Symptom number 5 Difficulty in organizing tasks and activities, like backpack or keeping back the toys back at the right place. The child room is normally messy. Symptom number 6 Avoid dislike or is reluctant to engage in activities or tasks which require mental effort. For example, unable to focus for longer period of time, or reading a full chapter, or solving lengthy mathematic equations. Symptom number seven, often lose things because of lack of attention, often lose things like pencil, eraser, or sharpness. Or a child took a ball to play in the ground, often forgets to bring it back. Symptom number eight, easily distracted by the external stimulus. The child's mind starts wondering here and there, what is coming in the TV? what is happening outside the room or even distracted by a knock at a door or a doorbell. Symptom number 9. Forgetful in daily activities. Routine which is part of daily activity, they even forget to do that like keeping all the books and stationery in bag. Some children even have confusion whether it's a Monday or a Sunday. 
After listening to the nine symptoms of ADHD in attention, mother looked worried, but the most surprising was the father being emotional. And after being asked, he told doctor, "All these symptoms, which are there in my daughter, used to be there in me when I was a kid, and because of my inattentive behavior, my my parents used to beat me a lot. Even after trying, I was not able to concentrate on things, and till now, I find it difficult to focus on things." which impact my performance at office and as compared to my colleagues i always get very low salary high now after listening to the symptoms of adhd in attention i am able to understand the pain of my child and what she is going through doctor tell me what is the next step and start the treatment as soon as possible because i don't want my daughter to suffer like me and he hugged his daughter Dr Rajiv Sharma says although in some cases children by age of 12 to 15 years do get rid of ADHD without treatment but a child with ADHD in attention have poor quality of life and unable to focus and concentrate in studies and which may lead to learning gap 20% to 30% of the children have learning difficulties because of this their performance goes down despite of being intelligent and smart they are not able to concentrate well and study well and which directly impact their grades in the class child level of confidence goes down some children feel very lonely in some cases which may also lead to depression and in some cases if adhd inattention is not treated it may persist for life long Being a psychiatrist Dr Rajiv suggests parents to give prime importance to the class teacher's feedback as a class teacher is in a stage where she can compare child's behavior with other students in the class in a day child spend almost 7 to 8 active hours in school this makes easy for teacher to analyze child's behavior pattern in different situations she knows how a child behave with other students and his friends 20 to 30 percent of the children have learning difficulties. Child have difficulty in reading, writing, and learning. Dr. Rajiv Sharma tells for effective treatment of ADHD, there should be a correct psychiatric assessment of a child, by which psychiatrist or a psychologist get to understand where exactly the child is facing difficulty. Is it in reading, writing, or learning? The three key main areas of child growth and development are play, school, and home. and out of these nine symptoms any child have any six symptoms continuously for six months and if because of these symptoms child is unable to concentrate and focus in any two areas out of school play or home then it becomes must to visit a psychiatrist or a psychologist as soon as possible because due to ADHD in attention child have difficulty in focusing and executing tasks have trouble in sustaining attention being easily distracted by external or internal stimuli jump from one task to another without completion problems with organization and because of this a child develop a very poor self esteem he starts feeling lonely and because of this some children may also go into depression despite of being intelligent and smart but because of lack of focus and concentration they are not able to study well and which directly impact their marks and most of the cases parents are unable to understand the real cause of the problem dr rajiv sharma tells adhd treatment is a long process but the positive results can be seen on child's behavior within 2 to 3 months and there is a drastic improvement in child's concentration and focus a child is able to perform well at school play and home adhd can cause anxiety low confidence depression or behavior problems Child with ADHD is like a flower which has color which has freshness which has fragrance but because of insufficient amount of sunlight the flower is unable to bloom and shine if parents acknowledge ADHD and it's treated properly with the help of a psychiatrist or a psychologist then your child will not only shine and bloom but also spread the fragrance of happiness all around If you want to understand what is ADHD hyperactivity and impulsive behavior there is a dedicated video you can watch it For any queries regarding ADHD please comment below For your convenience beautiful mind clinic address and phone number has been shared in the description So Rajiv and I Monica and a beautiful mind academy have a mission to share correct information and help million and millions of people and if you wish to join our mission do subscribe like and share this video with maximum number of people if you have any suggestion or queries please share and comment and press the bell icon to get immediate notification we'll keep on adding such informative videos if you don't want to miss do subscribe to this channel